Guan Zhu Zhou is set to make his Formula 1 debut in 2022 as he forms half of an all new lineup alongside Valtteri Bottas at Alfa Romeo. But who is the new Chinese driver and what can we expect from him? Here's what to expect from Guan Zhu Zhou in under 3 minutes. Guan Zhu Zhou was born in Shanghai on the 30th of May 1999. Zhao started his karting career at the age of 8, but in 2012 made an important move in his career, moving to Sheffield in the United Kingdom to take his racing to a new level and face sterner tests. In 2013, racing with the Sheffield-based Strawberry Racing Team, he won both the Super 1 National Rotax Max Junior Championship and the Rotax Max Euro Challenge. He made one appearance in the World Karting Championship, driving for Ricky Flynn Motorsport, alongside Lando Norris and Jehan Darulvula. Zhao's first stint in single-seater racing saw him join the Prima Power Team for the 2015 Italian F4 Championship. After winning all three races in Round 2 at Monza and consistently finishing on the podium, Zhao ended the season as Vice Champion and Best Rookie. 2016 saw Zhao join the FIA European Formula 3 Series, and despite a promising start, he struggled for pace and finished 13th. He stuck around in Formula 3 for another season before speculation suggested the step up to Formula 2 was in the offing. However, he'd remain in Formula 3 for a third season, scoring a maiden win in PAL, but a tough second half of the season saw him finish. P8. Formula 2 finally beckoned and in 2019 joined Uni Virtuosi. A handful of podiums capped a positive first season in the F1 Vida series and he was awarded the inaugural Antoine Hubert award for the highest finishing rookie. Zhao won his first Formula 2 race in Sochi in 2020 and would go on to finish 6th that year with 6 podiums along the way. He took pole position in the opening round of 2021 in Bahrain and converted the pole to his first feature race win in F2. He finished the season 3rd in the standings having achieved 4 wins, 1 pole position and 9 podiums. Podiums. It was an impressive return, but it wasn't enough for the title, as Oscar Piastri stormed to the crown. Nevertheless, the former Strawberry Racing Team driver made the step up to Formula 1 and signed for Alfa Romeo. And that's where we are now. What can we expect from him, I hear you ask? Well, he's a fast learner. In his first season, he secured P4 in just his second race and first F2 weekend. And he went on to claim five podiums, as well as a pole position at Silverstone. It's clear he can build on this and has more room to grow as well. This can be seen in his results over the last two seasons, which have improved year on year. This makes for a pretty consistent driver. And once he's in his rhythm, he's pretty hard to keep behind. It's clear he may not be the most talented, and he has a lot to learn, but if there's one thing he's shown, he's capable of improving race on race. And finally, he's got a pretty unique style. He supposedly owns over 100 pairs of shoes. In conclusion, he's a steady driver with room for growth and a mega style. Don't expect the world from him, but certainly don't write him off. He's more than capable. That's Guan Zhu Zhou in under three minutes. I've got just enough time to say like, subscribe, and I'll catch you next time.